Howdy partners, welcome back to Let's Play Red Dead Redemption 2 on the Mysterious JG. We have a new old horse. Well, we have... Now we have my horse rather than my lovely horse. We're also going to go check up on a friend who, um... We brought to Butcher's Creek, Obadiah Hinton. We'll make sure he's okay. Before we proceed to, um... Advance the story of... Rainfalls or weapons forbidden rainfalls. Oh, okay, well, I guess we're gonna have a weapons forbidden zone. I supposedly that I imagine the story will tell us about that at some point, but for now, that's a fun area because you can just bump into people like crazy and nobody ever pulls a gun on you, or something like that was going on before. Ah, be gone, sir. Be gone. Not, not, not because we cares not. No, no, but because we cares. What are you talking about? Is that guy got the devil on him or something? Oh. Sir, the darkness. The darkness, it's, it's everywhere. Well, man, it'll, right. some will come out tomorrow. What are you talking about? They come in darkness. Oh, They're coming. Oh, Our pigs have been claimed by the darkness. <laughs> Oh, that's signs of demons Very behind the shot. house. Keep your door shut. Oh, I'm a demon hunter. So demon dogs, huh? Safe now. See if there's any more of them. Oh, mangy blue tick. Coon hound. Shit, there's more, all right. There's all sorts of demon dogs out here. I'd like to pick up this pig though. Doesn't look like I get to do anything with the pig, unfortunately. Blue tick hounds are creatures of darkness. You can fail. I was trying to use a uh, dead eye, but over there. All right, I'll handle this. That probably wasn't the way to do it. So I might be able to fail this after all if I just dive into the water. Thanks for jumping yeah, off that cliff into the water. Keep these dogs yeah, boy, I'm almost dead from all this nonsense. They're dogs. This is a weird mission. That's weird. Because we're not allowed to skin them. Imagine the profit we could make off of mangy tick hounds skins. Hmm. Well, we'll return to the villagers, but I'd like to pick up that pig first. Oh, damn it. Demon hey, dogs. Nice. Get yourselves home. No, no, no. He said, he said they would come in many forms. <laughs> Including cats many next. He said his protection would come in many, many forms. forms. What are you talking about? It's just sick dogs. Uh, hydrophobia or some other poison. He said 
We were not to doubt him. No. Get your people home, mister. Then get yourself a gun and kill any sick animals you see. Life will be just the fine. Darkness has come for us. <laughs> yeah, but you're not supposed to doubt me. I'm like the angel or something, right? It's imitation Dutch. Oh. I shall save them. And who are you? Why do There'll I be care? No more four-legged demons. The curse shall change. The curse has changed. No, it's two-legged demons. These poor people. I will save you. <laughs> I just saved them, and it weren't no curse. It's just sick dog. Dark charm. Possess the woods. I Dark told you. extended he told word. He told me. Uh, I found uh, it. Oh, wow. Don't touch he it. He found the curse. I found it. So the woods, now the fucking curse. Full of these. While they remain, the curse will remain. Oh, is this another like? Look, Get we gotta find dinosaur muscles. bones and sh playing cards. Now we gotta find I will these. Find a way. Oh, have I lied to you thus? He never Whoa. lied to me. Well, I haven't played dire. poker. Feed me. So, Seymour. you're saying if someone destroys those charms, the curse is lifted? The woods are full of demons. And the demons protect the charms. And the charms protect the demons. It's symbiotic. It's impossible. I can see that. It's impossible. There ain't no demons. Don't disturb the woods. I told you, he would come, and he would help, and he would laugh. Well, you, you told us. Oh, well, I guess I'm a liar. Destroy the cursed charms near Butcher Creek. Oh, well, I guess we are being told where they are, though. Butcher Creek is safe from a pack of wild dogs. The details of the curse and the town come to light. Yeah, I mean, if they tell us where they are. This could actually be kind of fun. Um, I thought it was going to be a, like, annoying... Uh, you got to find, like, a hundred... You know, they're all hidden, as hidden packages style, and there's, like, dozens of them, but... This is so much fun, I'm not even going to go find that pig. I'm just going to hop right back on the old horse here. Start looking for a charm. See if I can save the town from this soothsayer. He's pretty clearly just bilking him. Oh, I suppose it could turn out there really is a curse. The, uh... Stranger guy who shows up and kind of taunts John Marston throughout the story of Red Dead Redemption 1 has not made an appearance. I'm just thinking about that now because I'm like, well, it seems like they're making fun of the supernatural with this, but uh, it could turn out that there's something to it. Because it's not like. Wait, press. Oh. So I guess they're kind of warning me about uh, demons could be coming. Well, there's oh the charms are what's lit up and. Red. Okay. Oh, and that caused rainstorm? Stains in this zone. 
Hope I seen as the villain in the original Iron Man film. I mean, I think he was a villain from the Iron Man comics as well, but... Maybe the primary takeaway is it was Jeff Bridges and that he had a giant Iron Man suit at the end, which projected his voice in like a scary way where they would add like this sort of timber and growl. But the monster also did to go, Arrgh! which fled in the rift axis. So it's Jeff Bridges just in there going, Arrgh! We got over a third of them. Can't carry any more common bull rush. Mint. I know like a mint. What other flavors you got? the wrong button there. I was getting confused with inputs from another game. A game where you can also call horses, but they don't tend to get killed by train tracks. Or trains. Train tracks didn't really kill the horse so much as the train did. If I'm being fair. I found an up armored charm, or I just shooting at it from a terrible angle. Let's <laughs> say, is that a demon? There's a thing a minute ago suggesting there's a charm up here. Yeah, whatever. This might not be the most exciting. Um, I'm kind of enjoying the chunt, the chunt, the hunt for the evil charms, the chunt for the harms. I'm enjoying the hunt for the charms, but it may not be the most exciting thing to watch someone else do. They're not uh, showing up because it's daytime. There was something that looked like um, like there was a lock icon on the mission. I don't know what's going on. Or I guess the lock icon means that something will happen if we go to that spot after we've got all the charms. Two left. I'm sure the last two will be the hardest to find because, well, I mean, they'll be off in the corners of this zone someplace. The more there are around, the more you're going to find the little icons flashing, and you won't be able to get that far without running into one. And the last two, we could have a bit of trotting about to do before anything shows up. So I'll try to take a stroll, a slow stroll through the area where we're kind of expecting them to be. Might be these things are right in the thick of the area where we started and the farthest, most, farthest out, most obscure ones to find are the ones we've already gotten, who knows.
Those are actual leaves. I thought they were evil haunted charms. I was mistaken. Evil haunted charms are magically satanic. Oh, there is one of them. Yeah, this seems like some place that would have haunted charms, doesn't it? Better horse really appreciates making us walk through all this crap. Is this red line leading me to the last charm, or have I misunderstood what it actually... Oh, no. It's leading me back to the way marker that I'd set. Alright, Obadiah, I got rid of all the haunted lucky charms or whatever they were called. They didn't seem to be defended by demons, but um, I suppose I could be mistaken. What is it called? The Wisdom of the Elders. Alright, well the charm is over. You shouldn't have any more uh, crazy dogs. Only legless dogs. You guys don't know what you're missing. We got legless dogs here. They're like cuddly through pillows. I remember back in college, and friends and I would watch the and Ollie show, and I can't remember the, the name of the character. This is a puppet show, like a silly zany puppet show, but um, whoever the sinister character was who appeared and tried to sell uh, legless dogs to uh, Sifo and Ollie, and they both thought he was kind of seemed pretty untrustworthy and bad. Jargon Scott, I think his name was. Like, it's a strange thing to remember. It's also strange, like, I was really surprised that I couldn't remember, because the name was, like, burned into my mind as f in my college years, because we just had this... That might not even be right, but the joke was that, like, one of my friends was like, yeah, there's like, there's something about that Jargon Scott character. Like, I feel like in future seasons of Sifo and Ollie, he's going to be like a major recurring threat. And something terrible is going to happen with Jargon Scott. And I was like, what do you mean future story? Like, future se Like, there may never be another season. And if there is, does this really seem like a show that has a, like a narrative thrust to you? <laughs> and it's like, well, maybe not. Like, Stealth was a recurring villain. The guy who hated Ollie, but the idea that Jargon Scott would be coming back and be part of a major Sifo and Ollie storyline just struck me funny. It's me. It's a me. It's Mysterious JG. Remember me? Remember me and Charlie? Dogs. I've been seeing about this curse of yours. Welcome, brother. It's a dark omen. Those charms out in the woods, they all been broken. Well, why couldn't I just tell them they were all broke? Why do I have to actually go do it? This is one of many Grand Theft Auto quests over the years where it's like, you got to go collect all 8 billion pieces of whatever and then come back and some silly ending occurs. And it's like, I could just lie and tell them I got the charms. All of them? So I guess that's it for your suffering. Ah! <laughs> it's a miracle! We're saved! I believe you for the some reason. Left it. Not saved. Huh? Cursed. Huh? He broke the charms and the spirits are set loose we're doomed then hold on you said the charms was protecting the curse look i said you're messing with my why are you messing with my thing here man i'm just trying to get some tongue. just trying to get free food out of these rooms I, I, I need to, i need some light here now i yeah i don't know what to think hey huh? look at me yeah i think something's going on in this holler 
And it ain't a curse. And whatever else it ain't, this fella don't want you to know. Liar! I told you he would lie and dissemble. Something's up. And this one wouldn't be so quick with ideas he didn't have some clue of it. I have the gift. My ancestor. Well, I got a gift right here. Tuberculosis. I mean, going this. to commune with the spirit. Dark, Not, do I have to beat him up or? Dark omens. Dark spirits. What is he hiding? He, he, always, he always spoke truthful to us. I guess this quest isn't over. We have to find the dark secret there of that a guy. Dig on the other side of the hill there. There was a dig anyway. It's closed now. He always said something about not going over there. Well, maybe I'll take a look at that dig. See if I can see something. Uh, uh, you can uh, trust me for some reason, even though... You never really proved that I'm on the up and up. Other than the... I guess I saved you from dogs. That's more than that guy probably ever right, literally boy. did for you. Oh, meanwhile, like the Obadiah Stain quest is uh, really taking over the LP right now. It's, I'm enjoying this one. There's an awful long land route to get there. I don't, I don't really see why you wouldn't just take the river. I, mean, I guess it would tire out your horse, but. friend I mean maybe there's rapids that we can't traverse but um, seems yep. like it's a pretty straight line up the uh, creek here close to where this thing is now. I guess I still want to kind of go straight across. I guess if I got to the other side of this pond, it would be easier on the horse. And I just got to pick the right place to cross the river up here. That's unfortunate. Jeez. <laughs> your horse is critically injured. Use a horse survivor to heal your horse or it will die. Oh, okay. Kind of didn't mean for this to happen again so soon. Um. actually get this uh, horse reviver out from is it already dead Horse is already dead. Yep, the horse is already dead. Okay, well that was It's not actually letting me use a horse reviver. Yeah, it's not actually letting me use Force Reviver. It's just, um... The horse has died. Oh, for fuck's sake. I loaded fairly 
When did I last save? This is... It's pissing me off now. Wisdom of the Elders. Four. Autosave. Okay, I think I got an autosave after I um, had that bit of dialogue. Where hopefully my horse is alive. So my brilliant idea to shortcut did involve, apparently... Because I was pressing the button to bring up the map, and I accidentally switched the camera. And... See me standing over the body of another dead horse. Well, I guess what I'll do is I'll call it a video here, and by the time we've loaded, um, I should be ready to go with more exciting horse murder. I mean, Red Dead Redemption 2. See you next time.